Grab a seat. You guys, yeah, you guys are good. So guys, we, we have all kinds of gizmos. This isn't one I invented, it's one I really like though. It's called the One Club. It's got bands on it and weights on it and you can work on that opposing momentum. You know, and so think about it. When a golfer gets really good, they can let leverage shoot out, find a nice math model, sort of that makes sense to a ball and turf, agreed? Rather than something that wouldn't create that develop momentum so easily. So this exercise is ready, one, two, three, four, hit it on the four drill, okay? It's a fun one just to kind of warm up start to find a little bit of math because what do most golfers do when they're playing you know they kind of get club on the ground you know maybe their chest dimension of the ground is different every single time the first lesson george newton gave me when i was nine was you know check my grip my dad was pretty diligent about that and so was the one pro i had prior to that and it was okay clubs never ever on the ground guys I never put it on the ground you see that you go it's on the ground no it's not that part of earth could fall away so the club is always just a comfortable measure so I have a better chance of mathematically being organized because if I set it here you know my, my the supercomputer which isn't that super anymore maybe won't make the correction in the how long is a golf swing guys one second long 1.2 1.3 if you're slow Okay, but most golf swings are 1.2, 1.3 seconds tops. The tour player is one second, 0.75 back, 0.25 down, Sensville. Yeah, there's the odd outlier that, you know, maybe goes super duper slow and maybe stops at the top. Hideki used to be very diligent, you know, do that. He doesn't anymore. He just has more of a, you know, normal looking golf swing now. Um, but he does have a little bit more noticeable pause than most. The, the reason I'm saying this is you guys did this exercise, which I loved watching you do. Some of you had a hard time, you know, keeping rhythm to four, which I get it. I've seen you at a wedding after one cocktail, Donna Summers comes on. Ready, and one, and two, and three, and four. Okay. So is it perfectly flush? No. But can you see how you're learning to develop momentum? in a tempo. So this thing comes with four bands. I think we have a couple more in my red travel case. Ready and one and two and three and four. Why is the why is the and important guys? Because it's it's developing the opportunity for a little bit of stretch for added rotation. Bob, this was a, where's Bob? There you are. The last drive you hit, buddy, what did I do with you on the ninth tee? Beautiful ninth tee at the Brute, right? I, I had him start from way ahead of himself, so he had a little developed momentum to help turn him a little, because you're still a little stuck in the, this look. You know, it's really hard to get things cooking if, if you don't realize that it's got to come from someplace else. Okay, you see this? That's why I talk about the hundreds, weight pressure in the feet, and how we use... I'm on my left foot for the last time, so I can use this to help sling it up to the top. If Jim's trying to hit it and win a long drive, you see these long drive guys, they literally are in here like super... They, they flex this so hard to get their hips to rotate so fast, so their chest moves, so their arms, they would kill somebody if somebody was like walking with a coffee down the line in a long drive and some guy's backswing hit him, dead. Because that backswing speed is more than most people's downswing speeds. There's nothing low and slow about it. Low and slow is the biggest bit of horse dookie ever. Okay? So low and slow, here's the thing, when you go slow and say your capacity it's 80 miles an hour, 100 miles an hour, 70 miles an hour, or 145 miles an hour, okay? If your capacity is whatever it is, if you go really, really slow and then try to go to 100, that feels sudden and quick, doesn't it? If you can kind of swing it up and have that stretch reflex, 
then, then going changing direction doesn't feel that sudden and doesn't freak you out. Okay, so now what we're going to do, guys, you did the ready one, two, three, four as coaches. How'd they do? Some good ones? I just saw some good ones. I didn't get to everybody, but the ones I saw. Jimmy? I, okay. So now we can take that, guys, and I did this with Schultz. -y. Was this? You know, there's, you get ready. So here's ready and one. So see how we can take a little exercise? Now, does that look like a fairly smooth swing? Yep. Sure. It's got backswing appropriate speed, rhythm to a backswing. Where'd that, where'd that backswing speed come from? Feet. In the in this sense of waggle waggle readiness, one impacts heavy there. Arms are getting long there. Lots of potential leverage there versus this. Okay, guys, so you're starting to see that. So now, rather than the one, two, three, four, let's do this. Five balls. First ball, I don't know, forty yards. Waggle, waggle. Oh, and by the way, he just did a bunch of shots. Some of them very nice with the club started above the ball a bunch, didn't it? Okay, so did you need to set it on the ground to cloak it under it? Good. Thank you. So, okay, so here's the first one, say 50. Ready, and one. Okay, the next one, say 75. Ready, and one. The next one, 100. Ready, and one. I, well, you're watching. I mean, I don't know if they're exactly the distance, but can you see how they're progressively getting longer? Yeah, okay. I'm just giving you an idea of energizing, right, to what the comfortable max would be. This is an eight iron. I probably hit it a buck 50. Okay, Jim hits it 185 or 200. Okay, he's an asshole. I tend to want to fire him every week. It's not funny, it's true. It's humiliating, actually. So, guys, so you, so you did the exercise. It was great. So now do the ready and one. And see if you find balance. Let's let it go 50 yards or 40 yards. Do the next one. Ready and. And now the and progressively is going to get a little bit more juicy, isn't it? Because it needs a bit more oomph to start to get a bit more yardage, right? Tr questions? Anything? Nothing? My left arm? Yeah. Okay. I mean, you know, I, mean, I, you know, I don't think it bends much if it no. bends. Now you got me thinking I'll miss the next shot. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no. Any other questions? Somebody was going to say something? Nothing? All right, let's go. So five balls, guys. Progressively longer. So 40, 60, 80, whatever you choose. Okay. Ready and hit it on the what? Hit it on the one. Yeah. 